I think it was two weeks out, so it was not too far out. I was in a supermarket and um, I kind of, I fell and I just, yeah, felt pain and was about to pass out and then through the next few days we found out that I fractured my elbow. I did everything I could though, like I kept swimming and just swam with my elbow out or in a like, sling and everything I could do. And there was talks about me not swimming, but I said no, you know what, like I've come here, I've put all the work in and I've come this far, like I'm not gonna let somebody else take my spot and I'm gonna do this. Looking back on it though, it does seem like it kind of helped me relax when I was there because I kind of went into the meet just thinking, you know what, like this happened, can't do anything about it, I'm just gonna do my best and have fun with it. So I kind of just like took everything in, didn't really think too much about the swimming, I'm just gonna do the best I can, like I can't do anything about these injuries. So um, while everybody else in the call room was really nervous and I don't know, like freaking out, I was just kind of you know what, I'm just gonna chill. I guess I learned that I love this sport more than I thought. Like, if, if I weren't so into it and weren't so invested, then maybe yes, I would have just given up. And, but because of all the hard work I've put in and, and just everything I've been through, it just made me realize how much I wanted, wanted to go and just swim and do my best.